Hi, I'm Danny Butler. And I'm Ashley Butler. And this isn't going to be like a normal trial tube video. So we thought for this trip, we would actually do some vlogging as well because, well, you don't really see that very often. So this is a trial tube vlog. <laughs> no, no, not the same. No. Sorry, I thought that was the cue music. Now the idea behind these vlogs is for people to get an idea of what we go through to try and make the videos and at the same time just trying our very best to uh, give a bit more in-depth, updated um, video content to the channel. So we have just got here to the uh, Palau de San Jordi in very nice Barcelona, if you can see that in the background. There we go, very nice skyline for the evening, lovely. And we are going to do a little piece to camera right now to uh, hopefully start the, the journey for our few days here in Barcelona. Now, these videos are going to come out later, uh, probably in about a week's time, but I'm going to try and update the channel over the three days that we're here, so keep checking back and give you some behind the scenes. It's not going to be super edited, it's just going to be like this, basically. <sighs> awesome! Oh, what a large camera you have. Oh, well, thank you. No. So, for those of you that don't know, the uh, Palau de San Jordi is a big arena here in Barcelona and many few years ago, myself and a bunch of English lads rode some pushback World Cups here as well. So, yeah, there's some history going down here. But obviously we can't get in right now, although we do have press passes. But we're just having a little look around and maybe even do some tourism. How many stairs? Right, so I think we're going to set a shot up at the front of the stadium and do what we do. Yeah, I'm in. Say, hi, I'm Danny Butler. And I'll go, and this, and you go, boom, and crank it right out as far as it'll go in one motion. Hi, I'm Danny Butler. That's the Palau San Jordi. And this is Extra on Trial Tube. So we've literally just done the hi, I'm Danny Butler bit at the start of every episode that we do. And uh, it was really easy to do, wasn't it, Ash? Yeah, I loved it. Loved every second of it. It's great. <laughs> yeah, people think that it takes um, takes like five seconds and we get it done. Have you, but have you seen how smooth control these hands are? <laughs> yeah, it's not good on the driving. camera. Right, so um, I'm going to admire the view again and see some sights. Just got to the arena, it's Sunday morning. We've picked up some press passes because we're press now, that's what we are. That's new. You know, when sometimes you get let in somewhere and you think to yourself, I don't think they should have let us in, that just happened. <laughs> but we've made it to one. Which means we can make it to all. <laughs> right, let's do it. Behind the scenes, let's do the thing. Right then, guys, so the main horn has actually just gone for the scrutineering test, so all bikes are being unveiled now. Everybody's making their way over to scrutineering. Obviously, a part of scrutineering is they check the frame, they weigh the bike, check the exhaust, a lot goes into it. I mean, like, Look at how trick some of these are. This is the top of the top. Right guys, so we're just heading back in now after we've just been out for a bit of dinner, out with Vertigo themselves there. Been out with a couple of dealers. James took us to a lovely restaurant which was a uh, fantastic food. Fantastic. Fantastic! Oh, fantastic! Well. So a couple of bikes on the back side here, having a little bit of a warm up. This is a, this is the moment before the actual moment. 
at the moment now on the beta. This is the moment for the moment. So on to the uh, main warm up now from the guys. A little bit of the moment just before the heats kick in. Obviously getting super booted, bikes from Bailey Hi, I'm Yohito. This is Trial 2.
rolling up a fair. So the trial's still going on, the trial's still going on right now, but we're going to go down to the floor and see if we can get right next to the rail. By the way, the reason why we haven't done anything previously in the <laughs> other parts of the trial is the FAM own the rights to video in the trial. So there we go. Okay, so we're backstage again, again. And uh, <laughs> I'm trying not to fall down all these stairs because it's a mammoth task. I can't be asked to carry the big one anymore. One, two, we've got sound. Yeah. Sweet. Just Hello. Say, say Hello, anything. one, two, one, two. Awesome. So we've been really smart, and right now the podium for the men is going on. So I've stole the lady who's standing on top of the podium for the ladies who rode fantastically tonight, finished on that, which is the goal. So I'm not going to ask you the generic question of did you have a good night, because I feel like that's a little bit by the by. Was it nice to be in an arena and basically showcasing ladies' trials at the height? Yeah, it was, it was pretty cool tonight. I think, um, I think we were a little bit nervous, because it's nerve-wracking. Yeah. And the sound, the atmosphere and everything is, is like, is amazing, so, so yeah. I, I just had fun really. I like, I love these type of sections anyway. Yeah. Um, I find it more fun than back at home, I'm a bit. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, it's nice to do something different. It's nice to do something different yeah. and the atmosphere tonight was electric. Yeah. And to be honest, we were on the edge of our seats during the ladies' show. So I think, and every, yeah, and everybody in the stands said that it should be included a lot more often and you, you, you hit the nail on the head when you did the, the mic and you said Aww. girls do it too yeah, so yeah. I thought that was really sweet and, and also you know it should be a ladies extra world championship I think that should be a thing yeah I mean this is a big step for us yeah. um, I think the organisers did a good job with the sections made it a little bit exciting yeah. I hope for everyone watching um, so yeah I think it's been a good night Great work. Thank you. Thank you for taking the time Cheers. as always. See you in a bit. 
So guys, it's Monday today and it's been a long couple of days. A lot of a uh, very minimal amount of hours of sleep, but most of it's just been filming, cameraing. Spoke to a lot of people yesterday, got a lot of interviews. Um, but today's something a bit different again. We've uh, all got up, had breakfast with most of the Vertigo team. Doug was there this morning. Um, but now we're going to pretty much gear up, head off to the main Vertigo factory. Uh, I think we're going to see Jaime as well, get a bit of a exclusive interview with him. Have a little bit more of a look around on the bike and as a general light really. I might even get a go. Maybe. No. Okay, so we're shooting in the lobby at Vertigo and yeah, there's a lot of nice stuff in the background obviously, but what can I say, they're long days and we're getting tired. We've got Berta who has had the bike a little bit of time, I want to say a little bit of time, it's pretty fresh. So Berta, what do you think? Um, good. I haven't had... Uh, no. <laughs> That's okay, we'll do it. Hi, I'm Emma Bristow and this is Charles Tube. Charles Tube, sorry. It's all right, I'll do it again. Hi, my name is Takaisa Fujinami. Try YouTube. Yes, Adam Ryder. Uh, your helmet bling game is strong. The force is strong with you, Adam Ryder. Move out of the way, fat man. Oh my god, that's Jaime Busto's back! <laughs> so right now behind me, this is the warm-up. This is where the riders all basically measure off to find who has the biggest talent. It's alright, it's alright. Did you get that? Hey, that was really good. Am I in frame? Did you get it? That was a shocking joke. Hey, ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like.